Welcome back, guys. All right, it's that time. We're doing another lot walk. Let's get it. Welcome back guys. This is Nick up here at Maple Motors in Hendersonville, Tennessee And we're gonna be walking around the car lot pointing out all the new cars That way you know exactly what comes in every Monday Check out maplemotors.com. I update that website every single Monday with new cars. I Do have finance and I do have shipping available. Just jump right on over to that website Today we're gonna be walking around pointing out the new stuff and just kind of looking at the cars that are on the car lot, I'll walk by them, tell you the year, the price. And uh, you want to know more about them, I do individual test drives on all of these cars. So be sure to check out more of this channel. All right, let's get started here. One last thing, if you like the music on the channel, that is me and my band, join us at Southgate Production. Gladly... Uh, I'd be happy if y'all went over there and checked that out as well. So we're gonna get started here with old Pacer. I believe we've already sold it. Uh, there was a guy that was talking yesterday. I believe he's already bought it, but this is a 76 Pacer for 10.9. Coming on around here. Got the convertibles in a row. This is a 68 model Chevelle convertible, 28.9. I already have videos created of this one. Going down the road and a walk around video pointing out all the flaws. Next to that's a 66 model Chevelle. This was 28.9. Get that top down. Coming around this side, a 65 model Le Mans GTO Cologne. And this was 27.9. Right beside that, we have a 72 Chevelle. It's on hold. I believe the guy's already uh, going through with payment, so this one's gonna be sold, but it's got a 502 in it. This one's set up for the strip. Lots of power, 27.9. 71 Monte Carlo. It's got the big block in it, 19.9 on that one. And of course, right next to this, we got a Super B clone. This is a Coronet. It's a 1970 model, 27.9 on it. It's got a 440 under the hood. We're gonna be working our way all the way around this car lot. We still got the back section over there, the back of the lot and the showroom. We also have shipping available. You can see one of our rides is already going out right now. Customer bought that 66 Chevelle, it's a project car. We had it listed last week. This is a 1966 Nova 27.9 on it. Runs and drives good. Same with the 67 Nova. They've got 29.9 on it. Right over here is another 67 Nova. It's 24.9 with a louvered hood. Next to that is a 66 Nova. It's 28.9. Baby blue. So we're coming on through here. A uh, I believe this is an 81 Firebird. It's not a real Trans Am. It's got the sticker kit all around it. Uh, it's got a, a earlier model front clip. And we got it for 16.9. All the videos are done on these, so you can watch test drives individually. Right next to this is a 79 Z28 Camaro. We got it for 16.9. And there is detailed pictures at maplemotors.com. You can see the undercarriages. Uh, here we like to pick out the flaws for you. That way you know what needs to be done. We, did, we just kind of skip over the good stuff. You can see the good. We'll tell you all the bad. A 68 Mustang convertible sitting here, 27.9. Green with black interior, bucket seats. And we're about to work our way back to the middle of the lot here. I guess I kind of blocked you in. I blocked you in, didn't I? <laughs> and of course right here, Got a Mustang, 37.9 on it. It's got a 5.0 liter fuel injected motor. This is a 65 model. 
It's a five-speed car, great for the highway, aftermarket wheels, and it's beautiful. Just did the video on it. It'll be coming up soon. Let's be sure to check on that. Right behind that, for 34.9, check this out. Say, so, woo-wee. <laughs> 1965 C10 pickup truck. Got the black chrome wheels on it. Disc brakes. And I mean, I mean disc brakes all the way around. Look at the bed on this one. This is a very nice truck inside and out. The interior's been all done up as well. This is gonna be a great piece, guys. I'll have the video out on it shortly. It's got all the goodies. There's a couple trucks that aren't here right now. They should be pulling up whenever we uh, get to the end of the video. We got some customers pulling up in the parking lot. <laughs> and I assume he's gonna be selling his Cobra. Don't have a price on it yet, but you can call about it. This is one of the personals. And it's sitting on the lot, so I guess that means it's for sale, right? Should have two of them coming up here soon. One's red, this one's black. I don't know if we'll have the red one back uh, before I get done with this video, but we got a showroom. We're about to walk in here in just a moment, show off some of the new cars that we got in there. This one's already sold. This is a 1936 sedan. This one's not available. Do not call about it. It's just here right now. Customer's car, so. Like 1955 Cameo pickup truck, 34.9 on this one. If you haven't noticed, the price has dropped significantly on this one since we've had it. Pretty rare truck, fiberglass bed. I believe we've came down uh, at least $3,000 on that truck. This one right here, 1970 C10, 16.9 on it. I got two more uh, C10 trucks. Like I said, they should be popping up here in a minute. By the end of the video, I should have them in and we can check them out. Coming on back to the back here. Can't leave out these cars. 81 model C10 pickup truck, 89.50 on it, white interior. This truck here, I believe, is already sold. It's a 1950 model 3100 pickup truck. You've seen it before. If you watch the channel, I've had the videos out on that one at least a week now. And of course, they got the Silverado truck, 7950 on it. And I believe this was an 08 model, 1500. Don't call on that one back there. It's not for sale. All right. Working our way back up here. Got the Jeep Rubicon, 12.9 on it. You can check it out on our website. We're gonna get back to some of the classics though. The bug is pretty cool though. It's not for sale, so don't call on it. We don't want a bunch of calls on this one if it's not available. So I think it is pretty cool though. I guess it's time for the showroom. Y'all wanna go in there? Let's check it out. So as we're walking in the showroom, we got a 1970 Chevelle with a 454 in it. Beautiful paint job, four wheel disc brakes, American racing wheels with new tires, tinted windows. This car is nice guys, dual exhaust out the back. Go ahead and lift this hood up and let you check it out. Oh. You gotta pull it. I'm gonna have to cram y'all into the paint. Oh, oh. <laughs> 454 there. AC on this car. And you got the insulation under the hood still. Upgraded pulleys. Interior looks great. Huge receipt book over there. And I'll be putting this video out first thing after this video, so be sure 
to watch it. Oh, oh. <laughs> Heading on back here. 1965 Mustang convertible 31.9. If you ain't coming to Maple Mark Motors, you're missing out. <laughs> Thanks, man. Appreciate that. You can check this video out on YouTube if you want. <laughs> I'll share it 50 times. Oh, wow. That's awesome. <laughs> Did y'all hear that, guys? You got some competition. 1966 Belvedere. We've already sold this. It's got a 426 Hemi in it. It is a rare car, so I like showing it off. And we got a 35.9 out of this one. Same with this uh, Impala. 31.9, got it on hold as well as the Cornet over there with 26.9 with a blower. Just waiting on a shipping truck to come pick them up. Same with the Impala that's sold here, but we do got a Corvette available. 44.9 on it. I believe it was a 64 model. Four speed transmission. Looks like they were working on the power windows to get all that fixed up. But the convertible Cadillac, custom interior, beautiful car. Got 42.9 on the window on that one. Okay, we still got some more of the lot left to check out. We do have wheels and tires available and for sale. You can see some of the garages back here. There's, there's at least uh, five or six garages full of wheels and tires. That we sell all the time. Coming up on the Trans Am over here. I need to go ahead and do a video of this one. It's 15.9. Main reason I haven't done the video on this one is I've been waiting on uh, a guy to mess with the carburetor and get it right because I don't like taking them out. And they're not running right. This is an 81 for 15.9. It's not running right? <laughs> no, the carburetor's a little bit messed up on that one, so we're waiting to get it fixed before we put videos out of it. Oh, well, I'll look at. <laughs> of course, the one right next to it runs good for 12.9. It's a 1979 Trans Am. You can't drive. You could drive it, but it ain't it ain't perfect, so I don't want to chance it. Well, we can sell it to you. <laughs> This is a 1965 Fury 12.9. Right next to that, got the Thunderbird 15.9. Old T Bird 1966 model. You gotta, gotta love an old Mercury. Most iconic cars, in my opinion. 19.9, it's a 1948 model with the white interior of course we got the 1955 bel air 29.9 and we already sold the monte carlo ss it's 15.9 as well okay i have two cars left to show you well actually more than that I, they bring them trucks back we'll walk back there and check those two trucks out there's a couple Corvettes sitting right here. Beautiful convertible 64 vet, 44.9. And then a new piece here. We got a lot of trim coming for it. Uh, we already ordered the little pieces and the windshield wipers. I think they're gonna go ahead and put it on the website so you get to see it today. It's a 1966 model, 35.9 on this one. Check out the front end. side pipes you gotta love it okay i'm gonna go back here they brought one of the trucks i got uh, another blue one coming here in a moment we'll go ahead and do a full walk just kind of cruise through the lot and i'll tell you a little bit about maple motors this one here is 14.9 we're walking up on it it's got the patina paint job got pat in there we're all family so this is a 1967 c10 pickup truck Up 
hopefully by the end of the video, the last truck will show up. I want you to check it out for sure. I believe it was a 79 C10 with a nice blue paint job on it. So one more recap, we'll walk the lot. Hopefully he shows up by the time we get back. I'll tell you a little about, bit about us. We're all family. There's the truck. Take the cone out, do it. Oh, <laughs> you should have ran it over. <laughs> the cone won't hurt anything. This truck is 10-9. Maybe he'll go slow so we can check it out. 1979 model. It's in pretty good shape. It's He's going to the back there. We're going to go back there and check it out. Since I'm up front here, we're going to do one more walk around the lot. Kind of check the cars out again. We are in Maple Motors. We've been here 40 years. Family-owned business. I am the youngest of every everyone here. And, uh, of course, my grandfather started it. My dad works inside along with his brothers, which are my uncles. Just kind of give you a little brief description about us. And of course, we're into classic cars. That's what we love doing every day. We don't really get into working on them too much here. That's why a lot of times you'll see a horn not working or the wipers not working. And that's why I'm here. I'm here to tell you what it needs. We do that with every car on the lot. And it also keeps our prices lower. If we had to fix everything on here, we'd have more time. We wouldn't be able to sell them as quickly as we do. And uh, of course it drives the price up. But if they're not running and driving perfect, like correctly, kind of like the Trans Am needed a carburetor, they usually wait on the videos on those. Does happen though. So we're just gonna cruise back through the lot here. We also have a Facebook you could check out and start following us on there. Of course, every Monday he posts all the new cars to Facebook and uh, our website. We have a Snapchat, kind of gives you behind the scenes. I'll post stuff there as I'm making the videos of the cars. Sometimes I'll just go ahead and throw them out. You can see what's coming up next. Our Instagram, we post videos on that all the time. And if you see a car on here that you like, you can get those detailed pictures at maplemotors.com. If you got a 650 credit score or higher, you can get financed through any of the companies that we have listed at maplemotors.com. We have cheaper routes of transportation. We can deliver these cars all around the country. And we also have more expensive where they're enclosed trailers if you buy something like this. We also have a Hot Wheels room, if you're a Hot Wheels collector. One of the largest collections of Hot Wheels around. And you can check that out at Jim Fights Hot Wheels channel right here on YouTube. I'm gonna tell you a little bit about the music and stuff. That's, that's me and my friends. We've been doing it since, I don't know, at least 15 years playing now, so. That's why I put all my music on the channel. I don't wanna use anybody else's when I have my own, so. If you like it, you like it. If you don't, I'm sorry, guys. I'm still gonna put it on there. <laughs> I do appreciate the support from the people that uh, talk good about it. I don't ever really like talking bad about people, so. I do try to get to all your comments. I see you, and I do like your advice. I take it in consideration. There's been a lot of times that I've added stuff to my videos all because of y'all. Here's that 79 model C10. Look to be a little 350. Um, I'm gonna decode the motor when I do the video. So don't hold me to that yet. I'll have it out in the next couple days for sure. Okay, we have walked the whole entire car lot. Remember, don't call on the bug. That's not ours. <laughs> I hope y'all enjoyed this video. It helps me out when you share. So go ahead and hit that share button. Share it on Facebook. And check out all those sites that I listed that we're on. 
We're always constantly posting to everything. I may have skipped over this Camaro. Is it an 86 Camaro for 89.50? Did I show you all this? I do have videos of it as well. And of course the uh, Trans Am here, it, it starts up, we could drive it, but it was kind of sputtering. And um, with a guy that we had that does carburetors, it takes a little while to get to it, but it'll end up being fixed and right. Oh yeah. <laughs> I haven't decoded it yet, so I'd be lying if I told you. <laughs> All right, guys, I appreciate you watching. Thanks again for tuning in to Maple Motors. I'll get you some of these test drives out through the week. Give us a call, 615-822-4444, and we'll try to answer any of your other questions. Hopefully this was a lot of advice. See y'all later.